Oh, wow. Okay. Got him. He's dead. It just kind of... Oh, my God. What the heck was that, dude? Many FPS games on Roblox fail to get something right, whether it be realism, gun mechanics, or just gameplay itself. But Black Hawk Rescue Mission 5 tends to never disappoint me. The realism and gameplay this game represents makes it feel like it's not even a Roblox game. I can play this game for hours on end without getting bored because of how well developed and thought through the game is. Black Hawk Rescue Mission 5 has many features that bring the game to its full potential, with many guns to choose from that you can customize character outfits with many customizations, and many game modes to play like open world, which allows you to explore a huge widespread map with a team, friends, or by yourself while having to go to certain areas around the map with trucks, helicopters, or even the A-10 Warhog, which is insanely expensive, but it's worth the money to save hostages and kill AI for more in-game currency. Another game mode or game modes to be specific is the competitive side of Black Hawk Rescue Mission 5, which are 5v5s and 2v2s. It's very simple and straightforward. Use whatever weapon setup you want, fight on different variety maps, protect or capture the objective, and whichever team is first to three wins the match. But now, with another huge update that was announced, Black Hawk Rescue Mission 5 has finally released their new 25v25 skirmish game mode. When I played this new game mode, it sort of felt like Battlefield and Squad put together. But let me know in the comments below what you all think about the new game mode. Back on topic though, skirmish acts as a domination game mode. Whichever team captures A, B, and C the longest will win the match. This is a huge change for the game and I think it is one of their best and biggest updates slash features by far. The map and player flow is very nice and realistic. You can either rush towards the town and fight in close quarters combat, or what I like to do is to stay back and sit on top of a mountain or rock and snipe everyone in long quarters combat with the new M110. There is also different perks you can use as an advantage towards the opposite team like Jeeps, Humvees with a mounted turret, a grenade perk, and also everybody's favorite, the new RPG-7. Another cool feature that was added is that when you are in the spawn menu, the tiny green icons that have a human rig image resemble your teammates. So whenever the icon is green, it means that specific teammate is not in combat. Whenever the icon changes color to somewhat of a brownish color, this means that specific teammate is in combat. My opinions on this new skirmish game mode are speechless. This is by far the best thing they have added to the game. Although, I think they could change and tweak a couple things about it, but I will go into detail about that when I play the game soon. For now though, this new game mode will change the game forever and a zombies mode is also currently in development as well. But for the time being, I hope you enjoy the gameplay footage of me playing and giving my opinions on the new skirmish game mode. Enjoy. Alrighty everyone, so I have a crazy loadout on the M110 and with a very um large suppressor anyways to get this off my mind before i forget um i'm gonna be going over like you know my opinions and things that should change for this update and so the first thing is is um when you're like hovering over a player i wish it would say their name before you spawn in on them so like if you're hovering over you know a person here it would say their name so like if you're playing with your friends or something like that you could see their name and boom you'll instantly spawn on them but yeah i think that would be a cool cool part if that would be added and also when you aim in you can't see like the green dot which is another feature that is like weird i think that's a bug i don't know but i wish like i wish it was a little easier to tell if it's your teammates or not but then i figured out oh wait there's literally different uniforms for teams so i can see how easy it is to tell now so honestly um oh Hey, Buster. Okay, alright. Well, I shot this guy in the head five times, and he did not even take a single shot, which is very hilarious. Alright, we're gonna we're gonna spawn somewhere like out here and see if I can get some type of better angle because uh hit rig in this game is still buggy kind of i don't know if that's one of my teammates or not
Got one there, finally. Nope. This guy can somehow see me though. You know, it's actually probably not that hard to see me over here to be honest. So I kind of like with the M110, it's kind of like it acts as like a close quarters gun and also like a long quarters gun as well. That's what I kind of feel like with this gun because like it's really good close range. Like very, very good. And that's what I like about this gun. That's why I wanted it. I'm glad they added this thing. Oh wow, okay. All right, well. That was very quick. Oh, and that guy instantly died. And I'm getting shot at right now. Okay, so our teammates are at B right now. So I think it should be okay to cross. Yeah, it should be okay to cross here. That is A. Please die. Please die. Yeah, see, that that's another thing. Like, I don't understand, like, what the reason... With that, it, oh, I think that was my teammate. That's probably why. And I just got instantly lasered. Okay. That's a guy right there. Okay, so there's two guys over at that building there. Got him. He's dead. So yeah, this M110 can be good sometimes and also not good sometimes. It just kind of... Oh my god, what the heck was that, dude? This guy just flung him in the air with a jeep. Anyways. Oh yeah, and there's also that. I'm glad I'm... I'm glad I went away from the house. I would have died. Excuse me, please die. Thank you. This game sometimes, man. It's just weird like that. I don't know. I think that was a guy. I don't know. Yeah, so there's a couple people over there at that building. Oh, shoot. Please kill that guy. Oh, he's dead. Okay. He is... That guy's dead. Oh, my God. All right. That scared me. Okay, he's dead. See, like, this gun's really good close range and also long range. I don't usually use this sight. I'm mostly using this... This site here. Because it's actually good. And that guy just got like a... More than a quad kill. With an RPG. Yeah, these RG, R, RPG kids are like... Nowhere to be found as well. When they shoot their RPG. There's a lot of kids on this rock here. Gotta switch to my... My actual CQC site here. Hi, buddy. I think this guy, I think that guy was reloading right when I was killing him. All right. And green wins. And I am not on the green team. I am on the tan team. So that kind of sucks. But, um, yeah, that's, uh, the 25v25 skirmish mode. Um, it's definitely one of the best modes ever, uh, that Blackhawk Rescue Mission 5 has added. Uh, thank you a lot. If the developers are watching this video, thank you a lot. And, um, yeah, I am definitely going to be making more videos on this game so uh yeah stay tuned for more everyone thank you all for watching and i will see y'all in the next video peace